All right, so you need to screenshot something to verify it. Now, on your um, desktop or your laptop, there are a few apps that are usually at the bottom, um, but one of them is called the Snipping Tool, and you can click on it here and it will open up. Now, if you don't have a Snipping Tool, you can always go here to the search bar and just type Snip, the Snipping Tool, and that app will come up and you can drag it down here or you can just click on it and it'll open up. And I usually just keep it right here at the bottom with the, the other apps that I use fairly often. Once you click on it, it looks like a little pair of scissors, it'll pop up, look like this window. It has new here, mode, delay. What we really care about is we wanna do a new snip. Okay, so we wanna be able to capture whatever's on the screen as a picture. So we click new, and then what's gonna come up is a little plus here. And you take the plus and you just drag it where you want it to be. So let's say I wanted to screenshot that I was on the Neil website. So I just screenshot that and then it is, and I would drag it and click it. And now guess what? It became a PDF, a PNG or a JPEG. Now from here, you can right click this, you can copy it, you can save as, or you can come up here to the little um, copy disk and you can save it. You could copy it, you could send it, you can even annotate it if you want it to, like highlight what you did on here very easily. So you're just gonna, you can either save the snip and then you can just save it on your desktop if you wanted to. And that's that. So just real quickly, again, you, if you don't have the snipping tool, you can find it in your apps down here, or you can just search snip and it'll come up. And then you just click new, you get the little plus, you drag it to wherever you want to take a picture of, and then it opens up a picture. You can do what you like with it.